What are, I mean, what are the risks? Um, because it's unprecedented, the idea of potentially mm -hmm. indicting the president's mm -hmm. children. Because right. they, uh, you know, to Paul Butler's point, they haven't been called either. Um, and to called. our knowledge, they haven't been interviewed. They haven't been interviewed. But I think, you know, Tim makes an excellent point when he talks about how involved the children are in this company. And we heard Michael Cohen testify to the fact that everybody in that company sort of uh, uh, knows that they have to lie in order to protect Trump, right? He said it became the norm. Is it dangerous? I don't know. I think this is unprecedented. We are in uncharted waters to the point where we have a president who's both son, uh, uh, the daughter, as well as his son-in-law, right? right? I mean, we haven't even discussed Jared Kushner and the, le the news that came out this week uh, about security clearances. But it is uncharted waters, and I have no idea where we're going to go from here. Could it, and maybe Eric is the smart one. Eric is the only one who seems to be staying out of it. Um, this, <laughs> no comment on that. I was just like, random comment. T Tim, how far would Donald Trump go to protect his children and his son-in-law? If at all? Uh, I think he would go to great lengths to protect his children. I do not suspect he'd go very far to protect his son-in-law. I think mm -hmm. he would throw Jared Kushner under the bus. I agree. If this Can starts... he do that I if, since Jared Kushner's married to Ivanka, his favorite child? Well, I think Ivanka's going to have to decide, make a decision at some point whether she prefers her husband or her father. That could be a dramatic moment in all of this. Could, um, could... But, but, Joy, to that point, though, this, you know, the smartest words that Representative Khanna said in those questions were and state crimes because yeah. the only way that the president can can protect his kids is by pardons well That's guess right. what he cannot pardon them for state crimes and so Robert Mueller and the Southern District are both preserving that option. They're yep. working with state prosecutors in That's order right. to uh, prevent Trump from exercising that pardon power.